Hello everyone. Welcome, X Pac Bless. Many years. Um I see a uh, question about if there's any fever tonight, and I have one answer for you. Fever. Hope you got it too. Pour me some Hello. Now it's all you gotta do. It's Christmas for Tinseltown, the Academy Awards. Pop up some popcorn and uh, come I on and bar now. Uh, uh, Who's gonna win? Who's gonna oh, lose? Uh, uh, special Yard blessings go out to reveal. Hope you got it too. Let's go! I love you. Bye. Okay, so I think that answers that question. Uh, thanks again, DSP Historical Society. I just didn't. Trailers uh, I just didn't want. Where's uh? There we go. Didn't want to uh, interrupt the song. I. Uh, it's okay. It's alright. I don't remember where we left off. I just kind of jumped 30 minutes forward to where there was kind of dead air. I think that's where I cut it off, so. I I can't believe, I just want to say this, I, I can't believe you're repeating shit. Um, I can't believe that uh, people get hyped for this. This is like some of, some would deem the more boring audio of Lauren, but uh, uh but uh, I enjoy it. Kick, kick, kick. Blessings, Jason. Um, happy Sunday. Sorry I'm starting early, guys. I just... I was sitting around and I'm like, I'm just going to do it now. Uh, Punk Pansy, it's... Uh, it's Tim Heidecker from uh, On Cinema, At The Cinema. He has a song called Oscar Fever. That's like the best rendition of it, in my opinion. But he's got a bunch... He's got a whole bunch of different ways. Anyways, let's get into this Yard Sale audio. Let me uh, drop the audio like I did last time, too, because it's very loud. Again, I have to go back through this shit. Shut up. You gonna start cooking some burgers? Cooking some burgers? Well, I need some place to put them. Hang on, Emma, there. Hang on. Oh, shut up. I think... I think that this is when we discovered that Lauren doesn't have seasoning. Why did you... Did you wash me in the house? seasoning at his house. He didn't even have like salt and pepper. Which is super weird. Uh, if you ask me. And we also had Cook's Burgers. So. Well, then I, you know, I bring that little refrigerator out here. What? Because uh, you, you, don't, you don't have any ice or anything in there to keep that, keep that stuff cool. Let me, let me ask you guys something. I, I know there's newer people coming in all the time. Does everyone here, one for yes, two for no, this is not an 87 answer. Does everyone here know what door dogs are? Let me know, and I'll tell the story if you do. This is 20. What the hell's that? Yeah. I'll go throw that in the trash. No, I don't think so. All right. Okay, so, all right, I'm going to explain it. So, 
Uh, there was a night where Lauren fell asleep and like was just kind of talking in his sleep and was woken up and he said something about door dogs or, or hot dogs or something. I think he said door dogs. Maybe, maybe Jamie coined the term door, door dogs, but they're hot dogs that are just sitting in the fridge that like Lauren and Roy go to their mom's house and just eat. They're not cooked. They're just out of the package. I mean, I know that they're kind of already cooked, but, uh, you know, it's kind of, I don't know. I would, not my first choice of food, but we, yeah, they're called door dogs. So like anytime Mama Gwen has food, I'm always expecting, I think Jamie asked if she was selling door dogs at the, <laughs> the yard sale. But yeah, those are door dogs. Um, Lauren loves them. Are you could have cooking hot dogs or hamburgers. All you got in here is hot, is hot dogs. Pretty much voice to voice. I'm seeing a hamburger. Pickles. <laughs> exactly. Oh, you point. get burgers right down there. He's like, I gotta get. Right. I, I dream about my mom's fridge and all the hot dogs in it. I don't know what else you want in there. I, you know, yes, another yard See, sale call. We're gonna. It, you get this right up here in in the way. Here, here's the deal on the yard sale stuff. So I'm gonna play the rest of this this part, which is about we got about an hour, and then there's two more parts to this day. I'm gonna hold off on them for now, and we'll sprinkle in some other stuff in between the yard sales because I know it's not for everyone. I'm gonna try and make everyone happy here. Okay. <sighs> It's impossible, I know, but we're gonna try. No, I don't want any of them. What'd you do that for? We don't need this on any of the tables right now, do we? I tell you, I should take and tell this roll of stuff, but that came in pretty handy having it on for the top of the stuff. What? They're so fucking yeah. good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Wow, I've never even... Uh, it just dawned on me. I got, had this roll. I was going to sell it. I said, well, why don't I just put it over across the tables? Right. I, I was in there looking for a sheet, and then I re remembered that I had that. Um, the, the doctor, I guess. There's many doctors. Uh, I don't know yet. I'll be honest. I know... I don't think Hillborn's going to put them up just due to I don't know if that's what contributed to the last shutdown or not I don't think it was because it would have said it but it's very slippery slope so it may end up on here I, I don't know I'll have to talk to Hilborn about it but um, Hilborn should have part 3 of Lorneo Drift done soon make sure nobody <laughs> All right, hang on. I'm gonna I'm gonna bring out a I'm gonna bring out a circuit bre breaker thing. Hold on. Circuit breaker thing. Mary, I think you'd be surprised. It's hearing, hearing Lauren at, interact with the general public is uh, is kind of interesting. You know, I mean, maybe not the most riveting audio you've ever heard, but you know. Uh, Just keep the talk, where the hell the line is. <laughs> That's right, Mikey. He's gonna go shut down the whole grid right now. Oh, crap. I don't think anyone does buy his stuff, Page Master. <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea. I might. No, I know, Mary. I, I get it. Trust me. It's 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 interesting when he does stuff. Like this. There are many times where I'm even listening to this, going, "Just hang up, stupid. Just hang up. Why are you why are you on the phone right now? Hang up." Hold on a second, mom. Who's gonna win? That's a great question, these news. Alright. I mean, unplug this. Oh, Ben, could you imagine drunk yard sale, Lauren? 
I I would love to see this that. in here, and you've got all kinds of plugins right here now. Oh, oh, bang, bang. <coughs> no, don't move my coffee cups back here behind your coffee pot. Uh, low, low, uh, low. my coffee cup, straight here. Lulu Bop, I, it, it has not, it has not gone back up yet. Again, this may that... actually wind up going around there because I'm gonna bring my refrigerator out. I'm gonna, huh? No. Oh, it is on. All right. Hold on a second. There's a, you know, I just, I don't know how to approach it, and neither does Heelborn, so not sure yet. So we'll see. Uh, I don't think he's ever not condes condescending to his mother. He's really rude to her a lot of the times. Come on now. Or like calling her fat, like at that Christmas. Just calling her fat for eating too much as he complains about not getting enough food. Yeah. And he just probably just said, oh, is it on? Oh. It is on. Oh. Uh, We're you together. go like this to see the light. See? Put your hands around like that. And you can see the light. Yeah, you have it on. Oh, yeah, we have it on in the light. You're not going to see the light. Well, it must not be working. Yeah, yeah exactly. the light's not working. Oh, why not well, bring mine out? In your barge. All right, you cook your onions and crap in that, and I'll bring mine out. I cleaned mine already, so I'll, I'll bring mine out, and you can see the light. This is definitely him and his element. For and sure. you can see the temperature that it's on, too. You can't see the temperature it's on on that. Kingpin, listen to that old bird squawk. <laughs> Yours sucks. This is this asshole? <laughs> yeah, McNuggets, I forgot about that. You remember when mom was hot? I remember when mom was hot. There's another one where he says, I always think uh, mom thinks about sex, but she says she doesn't. I don't the hell the line is. Something like that. It's disgusting. Quick card selfie or next time. I don't like onions. Roy making fun of Lauren not liking onions is top tier. Um, I know about as much as what was stated in the Casey call about Walmart. Um, it was brought to my attention there may have been something, so then it was mentioned to Lauren, and then I guess it, guess it happened. Now I'll say this: I know I I know the work he was offering her. He just is an idiot. He's talking about his fucking scam websites. But good job, dummy. Uh, Lauren's moving boxes right now. It's so good for you, boy! It's a great question, Mike Scott. Lauren never meant to do it. I don't know if you knew this, but ev everything he's done that's negative, he never meant to do. It's crazy. Oh, Because I don't listen to you. No, I'm used to mine. Yes. Mine has a temperature on it. No, and you can't see that one. Oh, you do what I tell you to do, or I'll just take you across my knee. Fucking what? Okay, let's hear that back. Let's hear that back. Oh, you do what I tell you to do, or I'll just take you across my knee. He puts Jamie right next to mom. You can put the hot dogs on that one. That's what I figured you could do. You can make hamburgers in one, hot dogs in the other. A little bit of both, Lulu. You take these, set these back here. I don't know why you think you got to have everything right there in front of you. You can turn around. I believe they're about to complain. This is coming back to me. I think they're about to complain, Lauren's about to complain that they're going to cook with onions on the thing and he doesn't like it. So he wants his mother to cook him food first so that he can eat it without onion taste on it. And by that, I mean flavor. Sure. I don't know, it's nasty. So you don't want, you don't want yours cooked in the pan with onions? No. There's yours. Listen to this. 52-year-old bitch! Alright, 
right, sorry. <laughs> It's nasty, Mom. <laughs> I like that. Like that. I'm going to bring you out a chair so you don't have to... So you can move around easier. No. No, you can't with that one. You got to keep... You can just wheel yourself. Here's an idea, Lauren. If you don't want onions, you get a pan out, you cook it, you piece of shit. I know someone who would cook for him. <laughs> What's up, Bobby? Damn it, Bobby. Doofy, baby. Watch out, honey. Nope, nope, nope. Over here, Doofy. Over here. Get him right away. <laughs> Onions are getting hot. How come? Oh, uh, absolutely, Punk Fancy. I mean, I'll be I'll be honest, I'm like this with some things, but I'm not gonna be a little bitch like this. Like if someone's making me food, I'm not gonna say don't do that, you know? I'll just if I don't like it, I'll take it off while I'm eating it, you know? Wants <laughs> to cook a biscuit. Oh, hey, right, move that chair. You wanna feel fortunate. Hey, uh, once you walk your ass, you come back right into that burner thing. What the hell is the matter with you? To his mother. Maybe I should let you do it, then you learn that for the first time. Now, do you remember when um, in Lorneo Drift, you guys might not remember this, but in Lorneo Drift, Jamie mentions uh, Lauren's mother's age, and he gets, because she called her 430 something, he gets all pissed off. And is like, why are you disrespecting elderly people? Why do you hate elderly people? Honestly, he sounds like he hates elderly people. Oh. I saw his mother. He's a fucking joke. Oh shit. Oh no no. I didn't try to fix pepper. This. I don't. I don't know if I have any pepper. I never use salt or pepper. I, I think I. I might have <laughs> some. Sure. That's a good one. I look. <laughs> yeah, I'd say. Honey, I thought you were still there. Oh, thanks, Shins. Appreciate it. I got you on one line, and I got you on hold on the other line. I put some uh, effort into that one. I mean, there are, there's always effort, but, you know, more effort. Than... I uh, I hear you, honey. I hear you. I hear you. <laughs> They're so awesome. There you go. Alright, now I'm gonna... No salt or pepper, there's no seasoning. Um, what, what's funny is like... <laughs> playing Wipeout. Um, I believe he said this to a few of his cat... His girlfriends, sorry, past girlfriends. Um, that, that his family is so loving and caring and they, they look out for each other. But every time I've heard them interact with each other, there is no love. There is no... There's not, it's not even like f friendly banter. It's like, it's just condescending, uh, people talking down to each other, Lauren complaining about Roy, Roy complaining about Lauren. Well, I don't show him the name, what the hell do I care? I never used them. <laughs> yeah, okay, but in a real family. Huh? That's because you haven't turned it on. Huh? You gotta turn it on. Well, you turn it on. I didn't turn it on. You see the light come on? Listen to his asshole. Is, is it plugged in? That, that might help. Like, fuck you, dude. Here, we're gonna put it right underneath it. My Move God. that cord right underneath it. Oh, no, I said under it. Under it. It's under. What the hell am I holding? Oh, paper cup. Yeah, Spring, or something like that, definitely. Alright. Probably was. I've never used it. Probably can, probably will.
Actually, I don't even think I put him up there. I think I think Roy put him up there. <laughs> yeah, this is a guy that loves his mom. Oh, nice. oh really? <laughs> Alright, let me go in and see if I can find some. Use your brother. <laughs> I never use it. I don't use salt and pepper on anything. Ew. <laughs> let's just let's just go back. I know you guys heard it, but I want to hear it again. I don't use salt and pepper on anything. <laughs> God, he even eats like an old person. I mean, even old people put... Old people... Older people put salt and pepper on shit. I mean, come on. He's an old, old lady. Lauren acts like an 80-year-old woman. Yeah, it's so <laughs> juicy and good. <laughs> kick, kick, kick. Hang on, Mom. Let me go and see if I get some more in there. That is a good one, DSP. <laughs> yeah, I guess he doesn't really need flavor when he's drinking coffee and smoking cigarettes all day long. <laughs> Can you... Oh, I'm sure what I did with mine. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a video. I, eventually, I'm making a Master Chef Lauren video for sure. Huh. Yeah, Bobby Gump is another guy, so. <laughs> Yeah, too. I don't remember that one. I don't remember that sprinkle, but I do remember the one where his dick was in peanut butter and jam. I don't have a clue what I even want. Yeah, Lauren hangs out with old ladies all the time. It's all he ever hangs out with now that Tony's gone. Yeah, uh, high value pizza shit. Yeah, that's definitely. Uh, it's this weird thing of he's like stuck as a teenager. What are you mentally, doing, pretty girl? Uh, but loves the lifestyle of an 85 year old. Scared of nothing? I gotta remember to. I gotta write this idea down. <laughs> Rock comment. <laughs> All his faults. What do you got, Lauren? What am I doing that for? I gotta figure out what the hell maybe. I don't even know what the hell I'm doing, huh? Yeah, you can. So Lawrence lifting things and going and doesn't know what he's doing. Yeah, leave a quarter on the toilet. You don't touch me. A quarter on the toilet. <laughs> the virus one punch that. Mom, I don't know where my salt and pepper shakers are. They're still in my boxed up. My salt and pepper shakers are still boxed up somewhere. I haven't, I haven't taken mine out. Yeah, Bobby, it is. All right. I don't. I don't use salt and pepper on myself. <laughs> what? That blows my mind. It, it, he wants no flavor. It's just like watermelon and fluffernutter sandwiches all day long. Oh shit! Let's go with this coffee and ciggies. got a drill going now? What the fuck? I do remember that one, Sprinkle. The penis stuff. Yeah, I remember that. I'm sure I think I have a hernia on me. I think she's right. 
What the fuck? Any guy? <laughs> what the fuck is that? Oh, Sharon thinks I have a <laughs> hernia, baby, and I think she's right. How much, how much of this was listened to before editing? Uh, the first the first time through, again, I, like I said, the levels are all fucked up. I gotta go back through and fix it, but... Uh, and then, you know, have Heelborn do something with it, but... Uh, I think it was just listening, in case, like, some random person's name was said to take it out. But that's about it. And it was like... Fuck. I think this I think this yard sale was like three hours maybe even more on the weekend, I think, is when it was. But like what? Jamie was doing other shit while this was happening. Like she was, when it was happening, Jamie really wasn't listening. <laughs> Yeah, I try. I mean, you know, Heelborn, Heelborn, uh, 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 Dude has zero taste buds smoking 40 to 50 ciggies a day. Love you, homie. Thank you, Gorilla Face Glenn. Yeah, definitely. I mean, there, there's nothing going on there except cigarette smell. He's so uh, nose blind to everything, too. Smell blind, whatever the hell it is. That he can't understand that everything he owns smells like cigarettes, but... It, it's a great point, and uh, thank you. Appreciate it. You know, it, it's stuff gets slipped through, but you know, for the most part, Heelborn is tr tries to take out people's names that don't, you know, are already, in, uh, are already out there. Did I hear you say you may know what took the old channel down? Uh, thanks for Mona's diaper. No, I don't. That's the thing. Um, I, I they, they did not give a clear answer, so I don't know. It was taken down for, and I don't know why, spam scams deceptive practices. I don't know how, because I was just doing what I'm doing now. Uh, so, alright. I don't know. It wasn't sexual content, but I know that their guidelines have changed since the first channel, too, and sexual stuff can get hit faster so like I don't want to risk losing stuff here I don't want Heelborn to risk losing his stuff over there you know what I mean so I'll conference with him and cross that bridge when we get there enough with the sexual shit <sighs> Um, yeah. Well, I mean, Heelborn's backed up, but I don't want to inconvenience everyone by having to resub just to try and get Dr. Armstrong out there. Good night, Alchemaniacs and the jabroni marks who don't know it's a work when you're working a work and work yourselves into a shoot. <laughs> marks. That's right. Uh, thank you, Hank Slogan. <laughs> One of my uh, favorite Hulk Hogan lines, you marks are working yourselves into a shoot. <laughs> yeah, he has a TV bl going non-stop. The TV in his bedroom, I think, is on 24-7. Uh, thank you again, uh, uh, Hank. Yeah, th thanks, uh, uh, High Valley Pizza shit. Um, <laughs> I appreciate that. I, I would really, like, I asked them to clarify so I could get a better understanding of what I needed to avoid, and they would they wouldn't let me know so I have to guess and I don't want to risk what you guys have out, what I have out there already for you guys I mean, you know if anything uh, I might throw it up on yeah, I put a 30 amp in there for all the OGs 
Probably because yours is no good. I might put it on the old uh, Mucho Ham uh, Sing the Dance channel. It's already got a strike, so. I might throw them up on there or something. Hey, one of them are. Or ask Kilborn to put them up there. Look, S some shit. Why don't you turn it on? Stop turning it. Look, you had it off. I just turned. Yes, you did. I just turned it back on. Shut off. No, well, it didn't shut off. There you go. There's not too much on that, Mom. Let me Believe say this. Me. I've got a third. I've got a thirty amp in there. Let me say this one more time, McMahon. I don't know either. I'm gonna. Where, where do you want the refrigerator at? Where do you want the refrigerator at? There or here? I think Dan. I think it, I think it boils down to the TV is his best friend. Um, it's just noise in the background. He doesn't like the silence and being alone. I don't know that he's scared of the dark, but I definitely think that he's scared of the silence. Oh. Might as well put it here. Be closer to this. And then I'll turn it with the clock. Uh, it goes long enough. He stopped watching Little House and started watching Three's Company. <sighs> I wonder why. <sighs> it's a different one. It is. The other one, that brown one I, that I get, I'm going to put that on the lawn sale. And the other one, I can hire, well, that other one that I had, I sold that. What does he say in that call? Hold on. Uh, let me see. We can just go like, yes. <laughs> what was that call where he said something like, my ears are still ringing from all the thoughts? <laughs> oh, God, he's so stupid. That's snapping off. So which one? John Ryan, I don't think the Jurassic Park was on his end. Ha ha ha. I know what I can do. Oh, that could be it too, Billy. That's right. Which one was it? It's all a blur to me. Hold on a minute. Mom, oh. I got to... Okay, Mom. I guess Jurassic Park was on his end. I didn't know that. Mom. <laughs> I thought it was Mom. <laughs> I got to plug it in the house. We can plug it in something different so it doesn't snap off. Well, maybe Lauren loves Jurassic Park. wonder. Yeah, hold on. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I remember that. You might. I don't know, Blue Boy. Maybe you really love Jurassic Park. I don't know these things. Oh, no, Billy. That's probably right. Jamie was playing the original Doom. Not Doom, what was it? Uh, 2006, 2016? When did that one come out? 2016? The original. The OG. Yeah, do mention it. All right. Then I'll... She was 100%ing all the levels. So, you know, instead of having this coffee in here, I know you like this, Mom, but why not just have mine out here where you can just pump it? And it stays, it stays hot for, it stays hot for 24 hours. Yeah, I thought I'd Ugh. You run electricity this way. Mine don't run electricity. Well, it's already got, it's already got caught dumping in here. What the hell I want to dump it in there for? Mine's already got coffee in it. Dear God. Mine's already got coffee in it, too. Bitching about where the coffee's going. Because his thermos keeps it hotter longer. Who gives a shit? Do you need the coffee to be hot 24 hours a day? Well, he does because he drinks it all day. But like in the grand scheme of things, who gives a shit? 
Now Lance turning into a robot. Too far away, it doesn't come in good. We're all we're all method acting right now. We're all, all right. We're all at a yard sale. See this? All you gotta do is pump the top of it, and the coffee comes out. Wow. And it's hot. She said no, motherfucker. Go put it back inside. <laughs> you fucking Jagoff. <laughs> Let the gorilla squawk. I mean, I just can't imagine arguing with my mother over what the coffee needs to go into. Who gives a shit? I don't even, I don't even know what you're talking about. Uh, this was... This was kind of deep into it. Uh, this was like seven, six, seven months into the, into the thing. <laughs> you call him Rodrick. Oh, am I interrupting you? Somebody sent me a text message. Was it you, honey? Text message. Was it you mind interrupting your time with a ride? Okay. Too fucking bad. You know what? Let's get Jamie on here. Okay. Now you can put all your stuff right in here. I did. Oh, you did? Well, you're a good girl. Ugh, oh, fuck I'm you. Why don't you put your onion crap in there? Your onion crap? Before it goes bad. You want me to bring the steamer out? Let me bring the steamer out? All right, well, you might want to need it for next weekend. Shut up, Lauren. You hear me? You can't, you can't park up there. That's my drain field out there. It's just, I, I hate the way he talks to his mother. It pisses me off. Especially for a guy who, like, screams at other people for saying things like your mother's stupid or your mother's old which is just a true fact <laughs> you know it's just a statement being made but this guy will sit here and be like mom you're fucking stupid put the coffee in the pump what I drain field I know that's why I told him they can't park out there she got that at the swingers club we're having it next weekend too so that thing you're going to put in Uncle Henry's, put it in for next weekend. I already talked to Uncle Barry and uh, Shirley. Uh, yeah, swiftly it is. He said they didn't watch them up next weekend. Sorry. It's every day weekend next weekend. Yeah. <laughs> Mom, we'll yeah, lay down and be good. I know. But you'll, you'll have time to. You'll... Yeah. And maybe you can sell some food too. Uh, maybe you can sell some food too. Uh, well, you get every look how you get everything set up. Everything's ready. Right all you got to turn, turn the chair, turn the chair, and wheel, and you get a nice smooth surface there. I can't remember when this happened, but one of the yard sales, Jamie brought up the fact that oh, yeah. uh, people had seen him. Oh yeah, and. He got so butthurt. He said, "Yeah, well, me and my family decided that uh, uh, put... we're not doing yard sales anymore. We're, we're done doing yard sales." She's like, "Oh, when did you have that conversation? Oh, a while ago. Really? Why did you just mention it now? Because of this?" Jamie, shut up. Guess what? He did a yard sale that year. He was just lying again for no reason. Like that was one of the few times where Lauren had a reasonable. He he, he had a reasonable excuse not to do something. People are coming to the yard sale and filming him, right? So you'd think if Lauren goes, I'm not doing it anymore because I don't want that. You'd be like, "That is, I understand. I understand where you're coming from, right? But instead, he lies and makes up this grand story about his family having a, like a, a round table meeting about the 10-mile yard, yard sale and not participating anymore. Just to look like an idiot a few months later. It's just, I, I, it's unreal to me. It, it's like even, <laughs> it's, it's I, I just don't get it. I just don't get it. I put a rope up there. I like nobody will get the years to drive up there. There's so much more crap to put out. I didn't, 
So I have so much more crap to put out. But my, my leg is hurting me. I just, I don't. Well, I can actually I'm probably gonna have you go and grab me another point. I mean today. I'll have you go grab me another twenty by twenty five foot roll okay. of plastic. So four millimeter plastic. And I won't I don't like using tarps. For context here. Context. Um, Lauren had said that the, the yard sale was gonna start between a certain time during this day. Now when he calls Jamie, it's past the times he said, and they're still setting up shit. We're now an hour into this, and he is still setting things up for the yard sale. It's about noon, I'm gonna say, maybe later in Cornville. Uh, maybe noon. And they're still setting up for the day. They get hold of them too easy in. This is uh, 2020. Yeah, uh, she does. She's she's complaining of the she's complaining in the process. So yeah, it it does run a couple days. However, there there is audio of him then moving the shit back to hiding spots. He's still moving shit out, and then the next day has to pull it all back out again. You'd think you just leave it out there, but he doesn't want to get stolen. He doesn't want his nick smoky knickknacks to get ripped off by. Yeah. Boy. No, oh. uh, I get a. I get. I get a. Yeah. I get a. See if I can get it in there further. They should make the ten mile yards for ten days. It would. It would really. I can get it over in the kitchen one. I'll be. It'll be all right. I got a 30 amp on there, but well, it's, uh, I got to plug in the wrong outlet. I got to get in there further. I can plug it in the right outlet. <laughs> that is a good name. <laughs> Seriously, it's like it's like candle holders from 1970. It's it, <laughs> it's like books and VHS is just. Cut, like you can feel the nicotine on them. It, it what I don't want. Why would I want that? A table that's just scratched to shit, and missing a leg, but it's an antique. <laughs> an old printer that doesn't fucking work. Yeah, turn TV off. Yeah, I'll I don't know if anyone's offered to buy his trailer no. except for scam artists, but. President of Italy, Italy or whatever it is, mayor of Italy. I'm building a house. Oh, I'm, going out there. I'm turning my trailer into house. Trailer house. I don't know if, if you don't know this. Lauren would go to the antique store in his town, antique loosely, and he would. He would find things that look similar to what he owns, but not exactly, and go, Oh, they sell this for $350. Okay, I can sell mine for $300. Like, that's how, he, that's how he worked. That's how he got his pricing. He never paid them either. He was just a piece of shit. Jamie's looking hot, how come? Hold on, let's move the LWO logo up. There we go. I don't want a VHS at all. I don't even care what it is. I, I really don't want it.
You're so special. I thought you were talking to me at first. I said, I know. <laughs> I don't know why he hates his mom so much. Probably because he wants to have sex with her. I don't know. You know, you're going to want to come out here again because this, this, is, this isn't even close to the amount of stuff that's going to be out here. That's, of course, my fan theory. But yeah, this is uh, the this should be accurate time for um, no, really when we're all fucked. Stand down. It's got that FBI folder. There's another one. There's another one over here too, off you. Yeah. <laughs> I think so, NCA. I'll double check. I, I don't know the times really off the top of my head here. I do. I've got several of them. She's going over look at them right now. Oh, shut up, Lauren. Hold on, I'll tell you in a second. You want a dresser stretcher? A dresser stretcher. She said it was too small, we'll stretch it. Okay. Okay, so the start of this day starts at 10.30. And that is... No, wait. Sorry, hold on. Let me re redo this. It starts at 11.30. And this is like the first 43 minutes so we're past that so we're at like noon now damn near uh like we're nearing noon at this moment we are there. oh to go around you got one of those stairs go around the corner yeah, so it's sitting in my garage and i have this ridiculous he's got so much garbage nca <laughs> like just boxes of trash that he he got from the teardown house or auctions or like He'll find people selling stuff at yard sales and go, that's a bug, and then he'll buy it. Like, he bought this snowplow once, and he thought he was so... He thought he beat the system. He was like, most of these plows cost this amount of money, and maybe he's right. He dropped, I think, three or 400 on it, um, which he didn't have to begin with, but he dropped it on that. Then he, like, got an argument about Jamie. He sent a photo of one that was, like, a grand or something. He used it twice and then sat out front of his house as he tried to resell it. Like, I don't care that he, you know, didn't spend an, as much money as he would have, but fuck off. Like, you used it two times. You have a gravel driveway. Like, a snowplow is not good for it, dude. My opinion. You're gonna be throwing rocks. <laughs> I believe so, JB. But yeah, he'll buy like bulk things. Like someone will go, I'll give you all this for a hundred bucks. And they know it's garbage. And he'll go, yup. And then he'll put it on the yard sale and make no money. But he thinks he's going to make all this money back. He also thinks that like... He also, th he also thinks that like... Uh, if he buys something for an amount, he can sell it for more because it, it gains interest over time or something. Especially valuables like antiques, jewelry, um, um, I'm trying to get other things. Like the snow plow, he thought he could make more off of. I think he was selling it for four or five hundred, something like that. I, I don't I don't remember that price in the time, but Yes, Lauren is the sucker. He buys the garbage, and then he thinks he's going to get his money back somehow. He's shuffling through his wares, guys. He's looking for the high-priced items. My God, you grown! Holy Christ! I don't know, Jim. I certainly know so many people, I have no idea who's who. Okay, Lauren. Holy crap. You, you not only grown, you've gotten old. <laughs> Look who's talking. <laughs> My God, he looks like Wolf or Dill. 
You look, Lauren, you look like you went through a couple presidencies. Yeah, you have Dealing with Winnie and Jamie, so fuck off. And and Casey. And Debbie. And and Ramona. All of them. Oh god. What are you doing? Lauren likes to act like he's not old. He says he says that people, guys, come up to him all the time and go, you don't look your age, not knowing his age, which is the weird thing. <laughs> They'll be like, you know, you don't look as old as you, as you are. Oh, yeah, I'm 50. Yeah, yeah, you don't look anything like 50. <laughs> Just like people come up to him and ask him if he's still singing in, in Walmart. It never happened. Oh, <laughs> There's a lot of garbage to go through. He does. He looks just like Justin Timberlake. He also says he gets many compliments on his ass, and it's not saggy, but then can only name Winnie as the uh, person to give him a compliment. Bunch of people. He looks old as fuck. He looks haggard. <laughs> He should let it go and chop that hair off is what he should do. But he thinks it's going to make him look older. Same with growing a beard. That's why he doesn't like facial hair. Because there's grays in it. He doesn't want to look older. He's like obsessed with youth, even though he shouldn't be. Especially after what happened there. He's just thrashing around. Like a like a fucking stupid chimpanzee. <laughs> He's got a hernia, apparently. Shins. That's what Aunt Sharon told him. He is thrashing around. I mean, come on. Oh my god, what is that noise? What is that? Sounds like a fucking cookie sheet 300 times. Someone having a hardcore match there? Oh my god. Is it another ECW re uh, <laughs> reunion? Oh my god, please. Lauren, I need to know. There's nothing more annoying in all of Lorne, in my opinion, than when he was cutting that lettuce on the glass cutting board with the serrated blade. Oh my god. Like, go fuck off with that shit. What is, is he hammering things now? What is happening? Yeah, no problem, Zachy. Oh, Tommy, I would I would pay to see that. That's like pay-per-view prices too. <laughs> I couldn't find my bread. Good. <laughs> Which bread? <laughs> that old bird squawking. I'm I'm going back. Hold on. I couldn't find my bread. Good. Which bread? <laughs> I see you decided to use the better one, huh? Oh, shit. You decided to use the better fry pan, huh? Well, it. You know where I got that? I gave it to you. Yeah. I you gave me that for Christmas. I, I don't mean to laugh at Mama Gwen's voice, but she sounds like a, like a cartoon character. <laughs> no, you gave me that for Christmas. What? And you said that too close to that. You're gonna, okay. I thought, you, I thought I was touching that. I don't know if he says chimp. I'll go back. Sorry, I was kind of talking. Oh, shit. What did I just do? Oh, fuck. Hold on. I clicked. I did a bad. 
I don't know where we were. Whatever, Louis. I think we're close to where we were. Sorry, guys. We had to go back a ways. <laughs> yeah, your rat comes first. I mean transmission. Yeah, it sounds familiar. I think I think we're like five minutes, ten minutes back, maybe. Sorry, I, I clicked the wrong bar and it, it sent us way back. Exactly what <laughs> this is exactly what someone wants to listen to. It's just bang. I didn't know. Loud, I didn't know. loud banging in the background. I don't sound like a cartoon. Some fucking respect on my name. Oh, I'm sorry, Grill Face Gwen. Uh, thank you so much. Um, can I still call you the old bird though? Uh, thank you again. They make it a fool of you. Oh yeah, he thinks Jamie's like gonna coom over this audio. Oh man, he's so he's so uh candy and he's banging things. Clearly he's strong. He goes <gasps> What the fuck is he doing? She should come back and squawk here in a second. Actually, hold on here. We can skip. I think it's right here. I couldn't find my bread. There it is. You couldn't? Where'd you put it? She's saying I can't find my bread, I think. Hold on. Lauren was looking for something. I see. You decided to use the better one, huh? You decided to use the better fry pan, huh? Well, I both it. You know where I got that? I gave it to you. Yeah. You gave me that for Christmas. You decided to use the better fry pan. Do you know where I got that? She gave it to him. No, you gave me that for Christmas. Now he's arguing when he got it from her. No, idiot. Christmas. Shut your old mouth. And you set that too close to that. You're gonna, okay. I thought, you, I thought I was touching that. He's micromanaging his mother. I mean, my God. Get the fuck out of here, dude. Me too, Amanda James. It's it's so it, like I, again. I said it. Cartoon character. Like it's just. I can't believe someone actually sounds like that. Bot. Don Sharon still have that water over here. Don Sharon still have that water over here. Oh, I said I put it over here. I don't know where she put it. Can't see it. Oh, right there. Honey, did you like when I was talking down to my mother all the time? She get a she get a bucket full of beanie babies too, huh? Oh god. Does she get those aren't beanie babies, are they? Yeah, those those are just regular pairs. Oh no. Leave them off. Leave the cover off. There's no money in those bears. Only beanie babies. I've got almost a thousand over there. Beanie babies. Yep. I think this is the yard sale where he brags about having like a rare one, even though he doesn't, and says that he'll buy a truck off someone with two beanie babies. Oh, really? Well, just, just think how many you can make out of this thousand that I got. You should buy them from me. Three dollars each. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I don't understand. Why'd you go running away? <laughs> uh, such charm. Wow. Three, three dollar, three dollars a piece, and then uh, I don't understand. I didn't know. Uh, yeah, no I, I didn't. Ever notice how Lorne's nose profile makes him look like a falcon? That's a newly sharpened beak. That's an ostrich to the heart. <laughs> Thanks, Mikey. <laughs> That's a newly sharpened 
That's great. Well, yeah, but you you can teach. See? Oh, well, tell her to buy them then. Hey, where's my money? Oh, you're not done buying from me yet, anyway. I, I don't. Trailers for sure. <laughs> because I don't even have close to the amount of stuff out here that I actually have. That's a trailer to the heart. I don't know. I can't see it, so I'm guessing she probably went into the bathroom. A newly sharpened low. Yeah, so far, How's it's just family. One. Not good? <laughs> sure, that's good. Really? Really? Hey, you uh, lost a lot of weight now? Oh, really? Hey. Yes. As a matter of fact, I am. I'm uh, Shirley. Uh, oh, she don't feel good? He doesn't profit on the yard sales. Uh, Ryan, the the most I've heard heard him say he made. Now, of course, this is Lauren, and he likes to lie about everything. So you have to take this with a, you know, you know, the, the, probably not true. He said he made like four fifty one time, four hundred fifty dollars. However, he had spent seven hundred dollars before the yard sale, so he was actually like negative three hundred two fifty on on the uh, go around. But he doesn't count that part. He just sees the profit. Oh. As, he sees the money he got as profit, even though it's not. Oh, shit. Fucking papers going flying. <laughs> Is that a sweet lady there, Allison? A sweet lady. Uh, Cheryl, you want to oh, see something okay. interesting? Uh, that works too, yeah. What'd you have? I got what you're going for now. I'm just on my way to the beach. Yeah. You didn't see that one? You probably didn't see that yet either. Oh my god. That's Korean War. Listen to that, guys. You haven't seen this yet. That's Korean War. That's the Korean War. He's holding a war in his hand somehow. That's the Korean War right there. Oh, really? Yep. That's that's where they saw the one pilot was taking a picture of of the other pilots of oh, the other planes. Uh, yeah, these here. Yeah, we can't. You know how much of Gary Cooper on the back of that? Oh, oh my God! Oh, you know, uh, know how much I'm selling? Know how much I'm selling them for? Seventy-five dollars, all of them. Yeah, but I'm not they will. You know how much uh, you know how much Gary goes and Cooper goes for just by itself? Sixty. Yeah, he declared DSP Historical Society. He he declared bankruptcy when he was with Ramona, which was a while ago. Um, but he'll probably have to do it again. Yeah, but probably a big one. has a letter from the Korean War. How how much money do you think he's gonna make off that? Well, right. no, this is Gary Cooper. It's a big one back here. Oh, sorry, the Gary Cooper thing. Oh. That's a big one, Gary Cooper. So let me tell you about this Gary Cooper painting. Um, he thought that that it was a real painting and he was going to get so much money because it was uh, numbered, you know, like it's eighty out of eighty-seven out of a hundred or something. But he doesn't understand that those are prints and they are like pretty. They're they're not worth money. It's not worth money. I'll tell you that much. But it's also got Judy Garland on. <laughs> Oh, no, no. 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 My God. They're all yelling now. There's a pilot that's taking pictures of these planes. Oh, yeah. You see, you see the form underneath it? Yeah. Yeah. Right, it is our cartoon, ADD. Um... 
You see the picture of the plane? You see what's under there? Yeah. Okay. What does it mean? It came out on the film. Oh, wow. That's it a is. Rabbit. It is. I made, uh, I made more friends than uh, I made Irwin one with the on. Let's see, he, now he needs one with a duck. <laughs> he, he don't do ducks. Well, he not. Oh, I thought that came out, but it doesn't. I suppose probably I take that money out of there, huh? He has got to be the worst salesman I've ever heard. Oh, it's all good, Sigma. Don't worry about it. Hi, uh, Sharon, you want me to clear that chair on there so you can... Oh, I can do it down there. Okay. Clear that chair on the living room. That's a great question, Sam Holmes. I'll clear that chair, that recliner out in the living room. You can... I think if Lauren figured out what NFTs were, he would start trying to sell his own. Okay. I don't know why. I, I think it's just the whole family dynamic kind of thing. Maybe they all know he's like, you know. <laughs> That's exactly it, man, James. He's an old lady, but also a teenager. Born would put his NFTs up for like hundreds of dollars because he thinks that someone would buy it. Comment. <laughs> We're looking for one punchline. Well, Lauren's uh, rummaging through his garbage to find something good to sell, I guess. As he as he's still crying about onions being cooked on a pan that he's gonna eat off of. Yeah, I don't like onion. Don't worry, he's coming back. Here we go. Burger? I do. Not a burger? Yes, I do. Yeah, Lauren's been working hard. I clear the pennies out of that duck. That duck rifle lamp. And you realize there's pennies in there. Oh. Oh, <laughs> Lauren took the pennies out of a lamp because God forbid he gets <laughs> he loses those precious pennies. Duck rifle lamp. I see the I see the. Are Aunt Shirley and Aunt Sharon both Gwen's sisters? Um, thank you, Ramona's diaper. Aunt Shirley and Aunt Sharon. No. One is a sister. One is a sister in law, I believe. Don't quote me, but I'm pretty sure. I'm, I'm pretty sure one's a mother in law or a sister in law. Yes. Yeah, thank you. Okay. I figured it was Uncle Clay's wife, but I, I didn't want to commit to that. <laughs> I couldn't remember. Oh, Egbert, you're, you're too kind, sir. I didn't draw that. Uh, no. What did she say? Hold on, sorry, I squawked over her. I didn't draw that. Uh, no. Listen to his mom even fucking with him at this point. My onions on it. Mom, oh, you want onions? I didn't draw that. Uh, no. <laughs> well, you want bot? I made transmission. No cheese. No cheese. Listen to this little 50 year old bitch. Mother, put cheese on my burger. I'm not walking all the way over to get the cheese myself. Put cheese on it. No onions. Chop, chop. Well, barbecue sauce. Listen to this fucking I'm prick. What, well, barbecue sauce? That's not barbecue sauce. That's ketchup. That's ketchup. I'm going to go get barbecue sauce. I didn't bring barbecue. Oh, I got barbecue sauce. 
Okay, Billy Badass, go get your barbecue sauce. Shut the fuck up. I'd put it, I'd throw it on the ground, step on it, and be like, eat that, you piece of shit. Doofy baby. God, he's such a fucking prick. Oh my god, never has, never will. No, no salt and pepper, but barbecue Ugh. sauce. Is he lifting the burger? <laughs> Is that barbecue sauce? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. It's just. It's just horrible. It's horrible. What is that noise now? I wish there was visuals to go with this. God. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you more visuals for this one. I've got the Oscar fever. Hope you got it too. Pour me some bubbly now, that's all you gotta do. It's Crimbus for Tinseltown, the Academy Awards. Crimbus. Woo. Mary Chrysler. Uh, thank you so much, uh, Tim Heidecker. I'm so glad you're a fan. This means the world to me. Uh, thank you, appreciate it. What's the matter, Doofy? Mary Chrysler. He's talking to the dogs now. We've got biscuit talk going. A little biscuit talk. I love you. My precious. <laughs> <laughs> well, hold on. Let me try and see if I can find this audio. <laughs> so, this was, uh, I think, kind of done on purpose on Jamie's behalf. Um really wanted to get that a golem vibe off of him, you know? Stop calling me a uh, baby. Call me precious. <laughs> My precious. <laughs> I believe... I believe the robot even coughs a golem at him a couple times. Precious. So I think Lauren's eating his, uh, Wham Burger. Stay here, Lucy. Can you count the feathers down there? Why would you say that? <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, eating a burger is very uh, <sighs> exhausting. That's not even going, is it? No. Oh, shit. Barbecue sauce more than here. Gotta have barbecue sauce. Shut the fuck up. Go get it yourself. How about you cook the burgers, you piece of shit? Sitting there complaining to your 900 year old mother to make to get you barbecue sauce? Shut up. There's malt in them. Big boy, yes, eh? I hate him. I think Jamie's favorite. Burger from Burger King is the same as Lauren's. Wow, what a coincidence. So I bet that water weren't cold. What do you say? Sorry, I was plowing over. I bet that water weren't cold. I don't want it. I got an idea. Uh oh, I just got an idea. I get an idea. Ah. 
he's on the phone with the robot, which is his girlfriend. I don't, I don't know that they were cat. There's a catfish, but I think that the person using the robot voice was real. Yeah, I don't know. I would imagine the robot hung up and just bitched about how stupid he was every time for a bit just to get it out. Mom, I hate to tell you this, but those burgers really don't taste like burgers. I remember this. Hold on. Let me go back. Just remember what he said. Mom, I hate to tell you this, but those burgers really don't taste like burgers. They don't taste bad. They just don't taste like burgers. I'm going to play it again. Mom, I hate to tell you this, but those burgers really don't taste like burgers. They don't taste bad, they just don't taste like burgers. What does that even mean? Listen, these burgers don't taste like burgers. They're not bad. They just don't taste like burgers. I think I have this saved already. Sorry, hold on. That might be a new dono. These burgers don't taste like burgers. <clears throat> They're not bad. They I just apple don't juice. Taste like burgers. I keep no. That's exactly yeah, it. Yeah, I I keep keep them. This is my bully comment. Also, WCW sucked and the NWO was overrated. Can I get a happy Black History Month, please? Thanks. Uh, thanks, Westmos. I don't know what you're talking about, about the NWO being overrated. They were peak when they came out. Did they get saturated with, you know, every member of the roster joining? Probably. When they split off into two factions? Probably. But, you know, they were, uh... I'll say they were better than, than DX in my books. <laughs> what do I know? Um, so there you go. Thanks, Wes. This is Gatorade. Time we got. I'm getting full. What time you got? James, do you remember when he used to, he thought about if mom still thinks about sex? Yeah, well, she don't go buy herself yet. She doesn't think I have. I really I really got Oh, okay. Happy, happy Black History Month, I guess. I really got <laughs> Happy, uh, I really I, I, is it happy? I really do you even say really that? I think I'm just really being like, ribbed right I'm now. Right there. I think you're ribbing me. <laughs> Yeah. I don't think you say that. I don't even think you say that. <laughs> no one's smiley, man. I haven't heard that in ages. What honorable celebrity? Making a fool of you. I do. Wee man, did you I know, know that, that uh, Steve Blackman has a bail bonds called Blackman Bail Bonds? It's true. It's a thing. Go look it up. He, he lists his experience as a wrestler as somehow um, a skill for, for being a bail bond. Oh, hell yeah. Okay. You know, you know so. Mm 
Lauren, shut up. Uh, a jabroni, a jabrone. Uh, it's like another word for jobber, pretty much. But also foolish person. Uh, Sword of Allison. I played it on my old channel ages ago, uh, and just recently found it again. People were asking, so. I was eating. That's why I wasn't talking. I was stuffing that wobble tooth. Well, I thought that I thought that thing was a book rack, and it put CDs on. I got two of them. Yeah, I thought they were back, so I'll bring in more water. Yeah. Oh, you know, I didn't know. I, 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 I didn't It's Hunter and I've got two words for you. Suck it. No wait, I have five words. Suck it. Any hoodle spicy noodle. <laughs> thanks, Hunter, for just telling me. Hey, thanks, Trips. Appreciate it. Uh, any hoodle. Back to the program. It's just him shuffling around and some someone squawking in the background. Count of three. Uh, go watch Wrestling Isn't Wrestling. I, I think that it covers Triple H's story pretty good. Overrated? 
I, I don't know. I used to hate him, but well, I mean, I guess he was doing his job, right? I guess I for, yeah, Katie Vick is. Something like that. Yeah, I forgot about Katie Vick. I don't know how, but. The game. <laughs> He would get caught with a knife. I mean, it's possible. So how 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 big is that? How big? Oh man, Eugene is the worst gimmick of all time. I got a thing out door. I see how big it is. Yeah, but that's just how I would make the the hands up. Yeah, see, see, JJ, for sure. Found the metal down. He can actually find the metal down. He's bolted right into the wall. Yeah, I don't know about goaded. You're talking stupid. I can't. I can't. What? Uh, not many. I don't remember 87 problems, but it would probably be like a handful. I'm gonna be like, we got customers. An existing gimmick? Oh man. Uncle Howdy. <laughs> BCW was great. I mean, I don't know. I just hate all the reunions. They've had like 40 reunions on television. We don't need that. Just come back. You're gonna come back. For all the wrestling marks, uh, that that's the end of part one. For all the wrestling marks, I made this the other day. Fuck you. It's my time. Um, I know. Hilarious. <laughs> all right. So that's all we got um, for tonight. I'm gonna do this. We're gonna. I'm gonna ask people. What's next? And we're gonna go. There you go. I'm gonna ask you guys. We'll run this through for a few minutes. I'll uh, I'll play the. Can you count the feathers down there? Part or something. See if I can find that real quick while we wait. Oh, see? This time it's not winning. Come on. Find the freaking thing. Oh, God. That's not what I wanted to see. Let's count the hairs down there. Here we go. Can you count the feathers down there on them? Why would you say that? <laughs> what? Why would you say that? Why, why would you say that? Why would you say that? Um. Alright, alright, we're gonna end the poll. Okay. We're gonna listen to something else next week. We'll uh we'll listen to the recontact call finally. I gotta get it together. Um and then we'll do yard sale again in like a week or two. Um after that. That way everyone wins. I I like it too, Amanda James. It's interesting how he can piss me off when I'm not even like the robot's not even interacting with him, you know. Um Line of the night, line of the, yeah, we'll say line of the night. We'll just start stealing all of Oni's gimmicks here. Uh, was definitely, um, where the hell is Mikey's fucking comment? <laughs> the newly sharpened beak. That's a that's an ostrich to the heart. Mikey wins for the night. He he gets line of the day, line of the night, line of the day. Um, I have nothing. That poll was a fast count. 
I mean, there were 78 votes. I should have waited till 87, but... Uh, thank you all for spending your Sunday night with me. Uh, sorry for the start, early start. I just, I wanted to go. I just wanted to do it, so. Um, here's a link to the after party. And after the party, after the after party is the parking lot party. Um, let me get that outro going here. Hold on. Um, thank, thank you all. Stay safe. I'll see you next Sunday. We'll, we'll hear how Lauren and, and Jamie started talking again. Just to put to bed this stupid rumor. <laughs> Anyways, have a good night, everybody. In Bay for life. I don't know all the words of the song, honey, but I like the chorus. Again, oh yeah. You're the love that rescues me when the cold winds rain. Again, you're so amazing. That's just how you are. And I can't turn back now Cause you brought me to the fire I need you like water Like breath, like wind I need you like modesty From heaven's gate There's a freedom in your love And it carries me through I need you I need you oh, I need you Like water Like breath Like wind I need you Like mercy From heaven There's a freedom In your heart I need you I need you I love you, bye.